Da! Hey guys, we have a all back here for the very first time with Wii Sports. Technically, the very second time. Let me take these headphones off for a minute because it is deafeningly loud. Because as you may recall, we recently did our setup video for my new shiny new Wii U, where I played a bit of Wii Sports just to get uh, set up with it, and. Lo and behold, it got voted on, so here we are playing the actual game. Our goal for this run is to do the following. 100% of the game, basically. This game consists of five sports, they are mini-games essentially, that feel very well-rounded somehow. In no particular order, bowling, boxing, golf... What did you do? Tennis and baseball. In each game, uh, every time you perform well in a game, which I think... I don't know that you necessarily have to win to gain points. But I think beyond a certain point, it does turn that way, but it's not necessarily that from the beginning. Nevertheless, as you perform well in a game, your like skill, experience, whatever rises. Once you get to a thousand, you're considered pro. That's what we're shooting for in all five games. But additionally, if there is a trade there are training modes for each game, uh, which was not something I was ever aware of when I played this as a kid, because as a kid you're like, ain't nobody got time for that. I, I wanna play I wanna I wanna play a game. Not training, are you kidding me? Each training exercise for each game, they break it down into like three or four different exercises, uh, gives you a medal, depending on how well you do in that training exercise. So we'll, we'll be shooting for pro in all sports and platinum in all training exercises. I have no idea how long this will take. Maybe ten episodes? Maybe a thousand? <laughs> Probably, if I, were, if I were to guess, it would be somewhere around 50 or 60? I really hope once you get into it, actually, hang on, let me just start and see if I can get into the menu and... There's a, uh, any kind of options for the sound, because, uh, it's really friggin' loud. There are no options whatsoever. I'm gonna need to work something out with these headphones, <laughs> because they play too loud and they don't have their own independent volume, and the monitor's volume is at the lowest it goes, but it's still pretty deafening. I might just hang it around my neck for the time being, and I'll just hear it that way, because it's that loud. I turn it up while it's around my neck. It would be way too loud to put on, but maybe I could just hear it. Yeah, I can hear that pretty well. Just having the... the the headphones on my neck. So I think I'll just, I'll just play it like this for the time being, <laughs> so I can actually hear myself think and breathe. So, rule stipulation. I believe it is possible if you are, it is clear that you are about to lose horribly the game that you were playing, that you can just hit restart or quit to menu and it doesn't impact your skill negatively, because if you lose, your skill goes down. Or, you know, it's like if you're performing badly. So technically one could cheat, therefore, and just say, well, if I'm about to lose, I just quit to menu and then it doesn't count for anything. Uh, I will try my best to play honorably <laughs> and not violate Dwarven Vow number 654 by so doing. I will only pull such a cheap restart uh, if, like, I don't know, my battery runs out or something. And did something out of my control that isn't my fault. So then before we begin, which I'm probably just going to give like a sampler of all five game minigames uh, this episode for the for the start, and then we'll, we'll start like focusing down one per episode as we go on or something like that. I don't know how we'll do it yet. Sky's the limit, man. It's our journey. It's our sports athletic adventure. We can do whatever we want. But there are two pieces of housekeeping I wanted to get out of the way before that. Number one, we're playing with the officially licensed Toad Wii Mode since my old, my uh, light blue one, which I think I was playing during the Wii U setup video. It's a bit on the old side, and as such, the uh, connector is a little finicky, and if you're doing any kind of motion stuff, you'd, the, the nunchuck and, and or classic controller or whatever is liable to slip out. So I got a new one, but... You need to be here for this, because I didn't peel the plastic off yet. Oh, yeah. Yeah, honey. <laughs> yeah, darling. That's the stuff. There, I've included you in the process. Now you're included. And the second bit of housekeeping is not really anything important either. <laughs> it's just something I found hilarious that needed to be shown to the camera when I was having a look through the manual. With Wii Sports, you are a pro athlete. Experience realistic sports sensations with controls that are close to the actual sports motions. How delightfully legally unenforceable. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be so much fun. I apologize also for the poor mic quality. The lav mic I'm using is not amazing. It's very sensitive, so if I have anywhere near my neck, then when I speak with my loud, booming, manly, ooh, ooh, e-boy voice, it peaks a lot. So I have it hanging around down my waist, which is suboptimal to say the least. But at least it won't be like peaking on everything I say. I may futz around with it and try using my actual mic later on, but uh... But now let's get into games, shall we? I think we gotta start with boxing, right? As you may recall, our champion with whom we'll be pursuing our epic adventure in sports hood... Not a goat. I think I'm right handed for all of these, so... It's time for... It's time for stance up. It's time for... It's time for fighting. Time for knock someone out. You're about to catch these hooves. I'm not using my wheel road jacket. Don't make me laugh. Our first sport, everyone. Let's hope we don't bungle it. I mean, having fighting with hooves should give me an advantage, right? 
Why does one of my fists look so much higher than the other when I have them both at the same height? I'm not sure. Is there like a reset button? Round one. Oh, that takes me back all the way. It echoes and everything. Sweet. One of my. This, why is this? Why is my nunchuck like so much lower? <laughs> why do I have to do this to make them equal? Or oh, it's before I pointed, I guess. Oh, I see. It's all right. Every time I have a guard your face, yeah, yeah. It doesn't feel like it's, it's doing it in front of my face as much as I would expect. Is, maybe if I do that, yeah, that's that's. Oh, okay, yeah. That's that's guarding my face. Yeah, punch the face. Yeah, yeah. Take that. Take that. Catch these hooves. Catch these hooves. It's not really, not really <laughs> having the accurate. See, I, I would hope from this. Come on, give it a hook. Oh yeah, right in the knee. <laughs> is that is that you allowed to do that? I wish they would actually punch while I was testing out the blocking to see if it worked. Because I'm not exactly convinced. <laughs> why why is my one fist so much higher? Yeah, 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 ooh, yeah, yeah. Get that, get that, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, it's so hard. <laughs> ooh, ooh, what's going to do? Oh, I'm too fast for my eyes, too fast for the eyes to see. You ever fought a goat before? Bet you haven't. Yeah, that's right. That's right, I know what you are. You're a human. Oh, we're fighting now! I thought we might have restart. Okay, uh, uh, oh, yeah. oh yeah, oh yeah, but you weren't. Uh, I can't hit a damn thing. <laughs> oh, that one. Oh yeah, I got the flurry rush. <laughs> Basically, what that is. Oh, this is gonna be extremely hard with the way the hands don't really do what I'm expecting to. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Jumping maneuver. Yes, take that. I'm a pro boxer. Catch these hooves. <laughs> That's right, I'm too fast for the eyes to see. Okay. Yeah. Ah! My defensive tactics are unlike any known to man. Ah! Ooh. Yeah, take that. Oh, this is gonna tire me out. But not before it tires you out. Right, I have no manual control of this whatsoever. I feel like I'm going for the gut, and it just goes wherever. Oh, the thing resurrected. I've got my <laughs> remote tangled in my headphones. Hang on. No one said I wasn't allowed to pause. Why is my battery so low? I barely played this. He's using the thing resurrection technique. Only known in the world of proest of boxing. Come on, you. I do seem to have a lot of health, though. More maybe than him. Oh, that's the end of that. Cool. Round two. So do you go back to max health every round, or how does this work? I don't remember how it works. No, you apparently you don't. Apparently I just do this until... <laughs> until I backflip him and he's knocked out. Okay. Um... Are you alright down there? Have I committed a murder? Oh god, what do I do? Oh no! He's dead! <laughs> My life as a professional athlete's over! Wow. I'm like a sick slow-mo replay to make you really feel awful. I just punched someone who did nothing to stop me. Oh no. Well. We're going to prison. You win. <laughs> you committed manslaughter. 75 experience. So glad it does not require you to use the pointer. Because the pointer's a little, a little iffy with this in the room I've got this set up. Well, we can never go back to that country wherever that was. Let's go play tennis. I think regardless, you're always playing. Oh, you have to unplug the extension for this one. Well, we always do it. Daddy Nintendo says. Right. Um. So single game best of three, best of five. I guess it doesn't matter if, if we better just go for single games if we're just trying to get the experience. Go for the shortest one and just try and not mess it up. Me, you, and Matt. A dream team. But I've managed to clone myself with expert tactics! So I'd like to see them try and tennis my tennis! My tennis overrules theirs by- oh god! This is not going well. Yeah. I feel like they're not putting as much power into it, or she isn't putting as much power in as, as I'm kind of trying to. It's alright, not a go. We'll be, in, we'll be in sync later on in our career. I didn't throw it, sorry. Do I have to press A? Oh, you have to press A. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I thought maybe my one in front would die for it, or not. I mean, they did die for it. They just didn't hit it. She didn't. Hit. Oh, also swinging it up does it. So you can either swing it or hit A. Okay. I nice save, Matt. I'm impressed. Not impressed enough. You have to be a little sharper than that to earn the respect of a 
not a goat. Isn't there like one way to do? Maybe I'm thinking of the uh, table tennis in Wii Sports, but I feel like there's a way you can get it that goes like it goes like and it, like catches fire and stuff. Forty thirty. Match point, and it's only one game, so this could mean a lot. Catch that one in front or not? Yeah. I know I'm doing it like a sword fight and not like a tennis racket. Ooh, wow, that was lucky that was still in. Counted as in. Uh, sweet! That was that! I mean, did we do it or did we do it? We win, I think so. Nice, nice. 45 experience, not bad, yeah. Probably the single games are the best there, then we don't have to worry about be performing well for an extended period of time. Man, I forgot how slow you get crew experience in this. This is gonna take a while. <laughs> I'll go baseball, then golf, then finish off with some nice relaxing bowling. Now, in the manual, I have to show you this. Under the pitching controls, for pitching for right-handed players, there's a little note there that says, swing gently. They're goddamn liars. I think you will recall well that in our Wii U setup video, swinging gently did not yield results. I'm on to you, Nintendo. You think you can stifle me just because I'm a goat, uh, not a goat? You think I don't belong in human sports? I'll show you! I don't care especially for the A and B buttons on this remote, so it's good they don't come into play too often in these games. Like, as in, you have to press them to make, change your pitches, but I don't have to do that with action, like with, with, with speed, because the buttons are very weird and clicky on this controller. Anyway, we've got the blue lions on our back. They would never let down a fellow quadruped! Okay. But my lack of opposable thumbs might... Sorry, it was just my depth perception. Something about the way my eyes are on the side of my head. Because <laughs> I'm not a predator species. I mean, because I'm not a goat. Come on, Dimitri. Let's activate that crest of blaze that he might break the bat. But if it wins us the game, he didn't even swing. I think we found recently that we had better luck with uh, just swinging it one-handed. If you do it two-handed and actually try and do the motion, it somehow it seems to slow you down or something. Oh, that was a double? Sick! Almost all the bases loaded. Come on, Ingrid. Usually had a low strength stat in most of my runs, but didn't make you less fast. Bad Apparently, dexterity ball. could use a little something as well. All right. <laughs> Sorry. My, I mean, I had a perfect excuse was that my eyes were on the side of my head. I don't know what Ingrid's excuse is. Single count to the single. Once again, two bases loaded and one point already. One run, I guess they call it. Come on, to do. I know you can handle it. They're always a star player in all of my runs! Once again, the dex is a little... that's a little something, isn't it? A little something to work on! Woo -hoo -hoo! But when you get that crit! <laughs> Level come. Ooh! Yes! Double? It's in the crowd! <laughs> I can run more than two bases at the time it takes them to get up in there. Yeah! Go on. Andy. Lightning bat! Lightning bat! I have, to, I have to swing it like Donkey Kong does in all the, the Mario baseball games. Just one-handed. Barbarian sticks. And that! <laughs> Don't be paralyzed by your desperate desire to do good by others. Just swing the bat, okay? We don't have time for this. You're the best and you'll always be my number one, but... Goddamn, dude! <laughs> swing the bat! <laughs> Fucker. Club that one hard. We're still heading points, because it's our work we start the inning, I guess, but... <sighs> That'll do. I don't gotta get this wrist strap off. I don't actually know how it comes off. Oh, you have to come pull it through there. I don't know. I'll just leave it on. I'll just hang on to it like this. So it's not swinging around. Oh, that was a double? Sweet! So that's, that was two runs. Sorry, I was too focused on my wrist strap. That batter is... Uh, pitcher is sweating. Storm. I'm glad that didn't count, because otherwise they would have caught it. Yes, Mercy! Nice. It's gotta be at least a double. One more run for us on the first inning only. Man, three innings doesn't sound like a lot. <laughs> Until you've swung this thing a few times and your elbow hurts. So my joints suck. I don't know if it's obvious, but I don't do a lot of baseball in my off. Time! I'd rather get a foul than I'll get right into their hands. You're a tad late. Don't worry. On this side, great! Oh, wow, that was just right. horrific. Five points for a first inning isn't so bad, though. So, in our Wii U setup video, there's the pitcher. <laughs> we learned that punching with the ball basically makes it go super fast and very hard to catch. Oh boy, except for now, apparently. Single. 
thank you for calling that a single. I was I was worried you were going to be a bit um, biased and call that a double just because of NPC privilege. What if I pull a bit of the... Yeah! Splitter! Yeah, what, what? What? That's not my fault. They didn't hit it. <laughs> Ball like it was too low for them to hit. Just do a quadruple backflip and hit it. Skill issue as far as I'm concerned. Yeah! Shame it was foul, because it totally had that one. As long as you just do a different one each time. They never hit it. I don't know why that keeps counting as ball. I just don't know about baseball. I thought ball was when it was too low for them to hit, but they didn't even try. Well, I guess they, if they try it. Makes it seem like they thought it was low. And it doesn't matter. I just noticed that Ingrid's the umpire. I mean, that one seemed like it was a bit out of the realm of hit ability. Alright, I gotta size you up here. What kind of throw are you likely to foresee coming? Not this one! <laughs> oh. <laughs> I should have thought about that a little harder. <laughs> uh oh. Please count that as a double and not a triple. Double. Are there even triples? I feel like we've had things before that should have counted as triples. Right, they're about two or three bases. We're gonna have to get one more out really speedy and really carefully. We're gonna mess them up there. Yeah, Two-handed like a samurai. Someone catch that! <laughs> Alright, one strike. The, the trick is to, to really start the throw quickly, because it doesn't read the speed for the whole thing. Not a foul, so not out yet. Just one more will do it and keep them at zero points though. Going for the going for the splitter. Keeps counting as a ball for some reason, but... Oh, it's an easy one to catch. Oh, it did. The count is out of the line. Alright, I'm going for whatever one B is. Curveball. <laughs> We've done it. First inning. You've ended up five points more. Mercy rule? What? I didn't know there was such a thing. We win by mercy rule. Yay! <laughs> I'm so happy for us. How many experience? 59 experience well earned, if I may say so. <laughs> What I was saying about, we'll have to, I will, I'll take the restart if we're ever losing. We're never gonna lose. We're just that good, baby. Let's golf. Golf's probably gonna take a while. Uh, I guess you probably have to play out the expert holes if, uh, oh, the nine hole game is all nine of them, I see, I see. Well, then let's just start with three beginner ones. You can probably still get experience from the beginner ones, just, I don't know, probably just not much. All right, our skill level, experience level is at zero. I guess I can do it like this, I don't have to. Stand like this, that's just silly. <laughs> I was thinking because the screen's there and it's like I'm trying to swing towards the screen, but that's, that's silly. I may as well do this so I can actually see the screen. Right? Okay, it's a little weird in how it determines if you're swinging or not. <laughs> I would think I should be able to just do- sorry, you're not going to see a lot of this because my camera's not that low. Maybe if I just do it like this. <laughs> I'm not sure. Probably is better if I just- I'll just try and hold it up a bit so you can see. Okay, okay. Sure, sure. So if I wanted to swing really hard, I'd have to wind it up a lot, right? Okay, so the wind up is like half of what generates the power. It's not really the speed at which you do it. Like if I did it from up here and then went really slow. That was too slow. That still counts as a lot of power. Okay. All right, let's give it a try. This, so the flag is like basically right ahead. There's a bit of wind. Can I turn like this? Yes, I can. Oh, the wind is mostly going against me. So I want to hit pretty hard. Uh, well, I should probably use the driver, which is what they set me up with originally. It basically is just weakest to strongest here is how they have it set up. I don't know much about golf, but I, I think I get that much. So let's give it just one nice clean, strong swing. That wasn't really as far as I was hoping. But if you go, if you hit the power too hard, like if you really like whack it, I'm pretty sure it curves all left and right and stuff. At least you did it that way in Wii Sports Resort. I didn't play this Wii Golf, Wii Golf nearly as much as I played, uh, well, I didn't play Wii Sports really as much as I played Resort, so. A lot of my reference is that. So the three, I want to get the three, the third bobble, but no, not really much farther than that if I want to get on the green. So I want to hit it pretty hard. Ugh. So yeah, I hit it too hard and it curved off to the right of it. It's going to hit a tree. Oh, wow, yeah, I really got the shot of the course because the three bobbles is all we were trying to aim at. Part of this place was three, was it? <laughs> we're probably going to get one over that. Does it tell me? It doesn't seem to. Okay. They're getting me to use the wedge now. Okay. It's all, there's a lot of this in the wrist that I'm not seeing. I'm thinking I can turn it like this, but because that would count as a rotation, but they won't. 
it seems to react more, like, if I do this, it doesn't do much, but if I turn it with my wrist, it does a lot more. It's kind of hard to show you <laughs> from this angle, but it's, it's just kind of, it's a bit, there's a curve to it. There's a learning curve. Oh, wait. Okay, I've also been holding it wrong. That, that also <laughs> is part of it. That was pretty weak, but, uh, he'll get me towards the green. It's going to be like a plus two. I don't know what, I mean, generally you want to be below par. I get that. <laughs> But in terms of what the game considers worthy of experience gain, I'm not sure. Oh, that was too hard. Bugger. No! <laughs> this is really, really a dreadful game of golf. It's a good thing we just picked the beginner course. You want me to wedge it from here? Why? Oh, sorry, no, that's right, actually. That makes a lot of sense. I had the wrong one. The two bobbles we want to hit is like a medium strength. That was pretty close. Thank you for that crowd. I, didn't, I don't know where you guys are. So, who said that? I thought I was out here in the, on the green by myself. Where are you? There's a ghost crowd watching me from somewhere. I bet they're behind that tree right there. So weird how, for a game with no narrative and no characters, basically, except for Matt and, like, you know, the other member me's that show up again, Luca, Miu, Ryan, etc., Eliza, it creates such, like, a visceral mood and playtime and place. Like, you know exactly where you are when you're in one of these games, kind of. Anyway, we want to hit it nice and gentle, not even so much as a one bobble. I don't know how to hit it that lightly. I'm just going to rock back and forth like this until it counts as a swing. It's not counting as a swing, everybody. Everybody, all of you lovely people out there, I don't know how to make it do the thing. Just hit it! Yeah, just like that. <laughs> I really didn't do anything. Double bogey I will take for that. Still have two courses to get that under par, shall we? Par is three for this place, because we're super, super close, but there's a water hazard. I'll even start with the driver here. And I'll just try and hit it at mid-range. Because with this one, I have to hit it at the max strength, which is really, really hard to do without going over, at least I find. So I'm going to go for the driver and just try and go with medium, medium strength. Also kind of hard to do, but... Oh, I undershot it a bit. Bunker, but it made it out of it. It's probably better than the alternative. We'll probably at least make par with this one. I'm actually going to go for the putter here. I know, controversial move, but it's just what I feel is best, and I angled it a bit to the right. If it was more out of golf, you'd be able to see the lines of the hill, but it looks to me like the hill is kind of curving a little bit to the left there. So I angled it a bit to the right, and you go for the... It's, it just doesn't swing it. Swing it! I'm asking you politely to swing it! No, not like that! <laughs> what? I didn't hit it nearly that hard! Nice song. Yeah, you know what? Don't patronize me. Uh, it's basically the same shot, but just from the other side, and I'm all on the green now. So I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna try and hit it gently, and it's... What? <laughs> not that gently! <laughs> so, it's, it's okay. You know what? I was actually pretty surprised with how well the other ones had aged so far. This one, not so much. <laughs> Consider me not impressed with this one. Oh, just, just damn it. Not, oh my god. I, I did that. It's the lightest movement. <laughs> well, at least I can't lose skill points. Give me a putter back. Why does that count as the hardest hit? Right, I have to put this on screen for you. It needs to be seen to be believed. So we want to go like one and two thirds. So I'll do like that, and it won't do anything. And I'll do like that. And it'll do one. So now I'm trying to hit it at a one. Nothing. And then after a moment. <laughs> but you really gotta work for that after a moment. I was having trouble with the boxing one, so I'll be fair. Baseball is totally fine. There's no problems with that at all. I never pick game design. The tennis works fine. And I remember the bowling being pretty good, too. The golf and the <laughs> boxing, broken. Do not work at all. Can't believe they shipped it. Paid money for this game. Should have just returned the Wii when I had the chance. All right, I'll try to hit it at max. See, that one, I, I hit way harder that time, and it was like, yeah, that was about max. And the other time I hit it like, eh, and it was like, over max, you broke the score! <laughs> like, shit, I ended up in the rough though. Oh, so I have like a half as, a half a range because I'm in the rough? I see, that's not good. So if I hit any harder than that, it would have gone way out of back. I see. Okay. I didn't see what the power for this place was. I'm gonna guess three. <laughs> That's probably four, actually, given what I'm seeing here. 
It's a shame it doesn't tell you. Oh, there's a bit of wind. Let's uh, account for that like an expert and go for that same maneuver I pulled a minute ago. Okay, that, that, okay now you know what? I'm getting a bit more of the hang of it. I, I'm trying to like game it a bit, and I should actually just treat it like a swing and follow through because I think that's kind of what they're anticipating. All right, it works a little better than I gave credit for earlier. Okay, we want to hit this one pretty gentle though. Okay, yeah, you really don't have to do the whole motion. I, I was expecting because it's, it's, I'm like, he doesn't know where the Wiimote is because he's not seeing the sensor. So I was assuming it was just doing it by the motion, but it does feel the whole motion, basically. Oh yeah, you can practice the swing before you actually commit to it. So you really want to hit that, like, follow-through motion. But that's too hard. Oh, I guess the different clubs require different amounts of force. That kind of makes sense, actually, now that I think about it. So for this one, I want to be, like, really, like, really light. Like, tap it in there. Just... Tap it in there. It's real. Oh, that was a nice little tap. But I want to go a bit more tap than that. Not that much tap. Okay, so let's just do this till we get it. Okay. You want to really get that wrist motion in there. You want to keep those arms straight and just pull it. In. it, it I have no idea how I'm going to get this to happen. Oh, actually, this is kind of like the baseball where it's easier to get the motion if you just do it with one hand. Even though that's not what you would actually do in real life. Okay. Okay, it is a bit more of a swing than I'm anticipating. For putting, especially, I'm expecting, like, to tap it in. But they really want you to, like, swing through. <laughs> okay, hang on. I can do this. I can make par on one of these. Yeah, oh, yeah! Oh, that was a pretty good try. Right? I didn't account for the hill at all because I forgot about that in the moment, but... As the swings go, okay, we're not making par. <laughs> can I just a little itty-bitty tap in there? Yep, yeah, no, a bit more than that. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be nightmarish. I kind of knew the golf would be the hardest somehow. Just a little, just a little bitty tap. Yes. <laughs> that was literally like, eh. Like, that was the motion I made to make that happen. Oh, no. Plus eight. I, you know, it still counts for 30 experience. I guess on a beginner course, they gotta, they gotta give you some leeway. Wow, well that was horrible. Okay, um, this ought to relax us. The, thing, the great thing about the bowling ones is that, unfortunately this is not Weaver's Sports Resort where we're getting all the stamps, because there's a stamp for playing a perfect game, and I just don't have that in me for right now in my life. Whenever we do 100% Wii Sports Resort, though, we'll be going for those stamps. But the thing about these ones is that the bowling does feel pretty consistent from my memory. Like, there aren't a lot of random elements in it, so you, you, I feel like you get... Once you get, like, the hang of it, you start bowling strikes pretty pretty regularly. Oh, do they want me to do this, or can I just do it without them? Okay. Okay, so that was really weak, but there's, like, a... Once you hit the right strength and you start feel it, find your groove. Strikes start to come pretty fast and furious. I mean, that wasn't a horrible first play. I got eight of them. So now I just hit the bullet pretty straight. Let's be sure I do that. I'll just go quickly so it doesn't have any time to turn. I twisted it too much. You can even see me. I ended up with my hand like that. I forgot that was a thing. Sorry. I sort of somehow, for some reason, thought that was a Wii Sports Resort only thing because of the motion. Plus, I have a bit of a twist on there. All right, it was too much twist. It's all right. Also, I'll go from the right here and I'll really go for that. Super hard throw. Okay, not an amazing game so far, but two eights in a row. It's a matter. It's just a. It's just a matter of finding your inner zen, finding your time and place. You know what I mean? Just line it up just right, and, it, and then you get that that nice bowling sensation. That was. I let it go way too early. <laughs> Yeah, that's about what I figured. <laughs> Alright, since, since the ones in front are kind of on the right here, let's come at it from, like, way this kind of angle and go, like, really harsh on it. Yeah! Oops! Let me get this out of the way before I take my eye out. <laughs> yeah! Really put that, really put that way too much spin on it. That's the tactic. Good job, me. I'm just gonna get that nice straight throw and Yeah, that's the thing you want. I, I keep, I keep ending like that for some reason. Thinking that will help. But you don't want that, you want Just kind of keep your hands straight. I didn't twist it at all there. Oh, if anything, I twisted that to the left. Why is it doing... Okay, now that one wasn't my fault. The other ones were totally my fault. Uh, bad game. Can't believe that this one game of the year in 2024. Which hasn't happened yet. But it's about finding your time and place and not twisting it like that. It's all it is. It's a simple video game. Oh, oh no. No, how could this happen to me in my bloodline? The goat family, I mean, the not-a-goat family. They'll be so disappointed. 
you know, my affinity for high single digit numbers here. Maybe, maybe if I keep accidentally turning to the right, maybe I should just do it like this. That way it curves right to where I'm trying to go. Yeah, that thought was almost right if I just <laughs> moved a bit more to the side like this. And then just deliberately force a curve to the right. Yeah, that'll work eventually. Let's do that for a while. Just curve it all the way hard right and it slams like that. Yeah, that's the thing you want to do. Okay, right. Nice if it's gonna keep curving to the right, you know, improvise, adapt, overcome. Endure and survive. To the edge of the universe and back, catch you waiting, huh, etc. Phew! Oh, that's working a charm every time, except for that one. <laughs> uh, let's just hang a little bit here, uh, anticipating a slight curve to the right, as it likes to do. Let it curve to the left. I don't feel like I'm doing much to enforce that. I think it's the twist of your hand by the end of the throw that makes it... Well, the throw? <laughs> You're not supposed to throw it. Anyway, this is what we want. I think this was easier. Is you just throw it here with like hard right curve, but so that it curves right into the, the center pin. So like that, but a little better. Throw it like really properly, like... And... Curve right! Yeah, not bad. Not bad. For our first attempt, we're doing okay here. I can't be too mad at myself. For messing it up all those times, especially as it wasn't my fault. But seriously, <laughs> I'm, I'm learning. I'm relearning as well. It's okay. It takes time. Put it hard right. Yeah, that's the stuff. When you when you see it curving right towards that center pin, you know you got that enough force to bring it all down. And because that's the tenth one, we also get another one, right? So we do. And okay, uh, let me just drop that there because it didn't do what I was expecting. Let's try that again. <laughs> Okay. And throw that with that. Ooh, it wasn't quite. It was the right curve, but it was not enough power. Oh, but it was almost just enough. It would have been a little faster. That one, they would have hit the ninth, hit, at the tenth pin there. It's just a modicum of force. I'm gonna, I'm gonna curve. I'm gonna do it a bit of this and then curve it just ever so gently to the right. Like that. See, that's a gentle curve to the right. You see my hand? Oh, not that. <laughs> I had to throw it faster if I wanted the spin to take effect slower. Well, 93 pins is, uh, it, it is a game of bowling. Oh, actually kind of has a lot of experience. 141. Not bad. I mean, to, to be, I think technically speaking, our performance there was better than any of the other ones we tried. So 141 experience does not exactly surprise me. Got a few strikes in there, good overall score, like, you know, a passable overall score. And that does it for part one of Wii Sports, my friends. I think the smart thing to do in part two would be to play only golf so I can get better at it because clearly that's the one that's going to give us the most trouble. Definitely for sure. And the boxing, actually. I might focus down those two for our, our first, like, ten or so episodes. Oh man, I'm not looking forward to doing the golf training exercises either. I'm not sure, I've not decided just yet w in what order I should do them. I mean, you would think the training ones first, but for some, ha for some reason to me it seems like they'll be harder. Because <laughs> a platinum score, to I, as far as I understand, basically means getting to practice exercises like 100% right. Well, it's a long road to 100%, folks, but I'm glad to have you at my side. Not a goat and I will eagerly await our next encounter. That's all for now. Next video going on the channel is going to be some more Kiddick Eris Uprising, where we're headed to Chapter 21, whose name I don't remember at all. The Chaos Vortex, right? I think that was it. That'll be fun. Thank you so very much for coming around. Hopefully I'll see you around. I'm almost going to be out of here now. Peace! The fact that you haven't yet hidden that mark yet proves you're still a rebel. <laughs> Last point to cover. Think what you want, but you don't know nothing about me. You're wrong. You wear your heart and your beliefs right on your sleeve, just like me. And this is what I believe in. Take that! <laughs>